Hey guys, I'm Kyoko. Welcome to Rebel Cops. This game is a spin-off of This is the Police, which I also played on my channel some time ago. And in this spin-off, well, the criminals have taken over the town and have the actual police officers on their payroll. So what we get to do is, well, set up a rebel force and go fight everything. So, this should be fun. Let's go. Uh, well, I think we're gonna go with normal mode for those who want to experience the game the way it's intended. Yes. Now this game is releasing today, 17th of September, on Steam. And uh, let's hope it's gonna be fun. Let's hope it's gonna be fun. Bank robbery. About 10 armed robbers burst into central offices of Azam and Sons Bank. They demand entrance to the vault. But it looks like their goal isn't just to make off with as much money as possible, but to show everyone what happens to businesses who won't play along. Let's proceed. The bank's owner, Daniel Azam, is the only major entrepreneur in the area who refused to bow to Victor Zuel, the mysterious criminal boss who has seized all of Ripton over the past few months. Zuel has sole authority in the town. He controls not only the businessmen, but also the local officials, and even law enforcement. Azam better not be counting on the police to save his bank. They are on Zuel's payroll. Well then, for fortunately, we are not exactly the police. No, we are not. We are rebel cops. Let's get in there. Looks like this is us. Turn one. So this is turn based. We get to move around and do stuff. So we have Shreds, Limit, Allardyce and Boone. Uh, I will go and I will lower the audio slightly more. This is acceptable. Okay, good. Now, you want me to go here. A cop usually performs two actions each turn. Moving a short distance takes one action. Okay. Okay. Go there, live it. We shall approach. I don't you think bet. going over here without any cover is the smartest idea. A cop can advance further, but this spends both his actions. It's usually dangerous to advance with abandon. A cop who stumbles over a criminal is a threat not only to himself, but to the whole operation. So this, is, this works like, you know, XCOM 2, uh, where we... We're fighting aliens who took over our world, so hey, here we go. Objects that you can interact with are outlined. The different colors represent the types of objects and their importance to the mission. I think we can interact with that. Right away. But let's see. Maybe you can look through the window. Suspect's turn. It did nothing. Yes, we will move the camera. WASD. Where is this guy? Is he the sniper? He might be a sniper that we can control from far away. Let's go to the window. Before entering the building, it's smart to scope it out through the windows. You might see something that changes your done plan. And done. done and done. Okay, so we he we can see some boys over here. That's a suspect. That's a suspect. Well, let's go over here. Every active object has an indicator. Select it and you'll see things you can't do with this object. All right. Okay. Let's go here. And uh, we can open the window. Will do. Will do. That seems smart. Opening the window so the suspect can shoot us through. Right away. Seems like a good There's idea. Somebody over here. Ooh, another suspect. Well, let us open the window then. You got it. <coughs> so he gets the chance to shoot us. Or something. Uh, they're not aware of us. At least yet. What is this guy doing? Is he smoking? Like, they're, they're not even paying attention. <laughs> Hide behind the table. Cameras can't see cops in cover. Really? You're saying this this man over here is not gonna see me over here. Well, let's see that. Yeah, that one is definitely confused what's going on. Approach the criminal. If a perpetrator notices something suspicious from a distance, he'll become worried and especially attentive. You can try to hide from him, but if you're spotted by someone who's already suspicious, they'll immediately raise the alarm. Well, that's why we're just gonna run into their face. Seems like a good idea. This guy saw something, and now we can stun them with a baton. Strike the criminal in the head with a baton, stunning him for two turns. In situations like that, a knife works as well if you're willing to have that on your conscience. Well, I do. Uh, just tell me how do I actually do this. Um, there's our baton. Okay. Yes. Uh, how do I actually do this? Ah, oh, there you go. Just click on you, and we have the options what to use. Right. Right away. It's been a while since I played uh, This is the Police 2, so hey. Order the criminal to freeze. A cop can get the jump on a criminal and hold him at gunpoint for a turn. Freeze, my friend. Freeze, asshole. 
Or asshole, you know, that's also a thing. Hide behind the shelves, let's do this. Full cover offers better protection from gunfire, but it also blocks your view. Does it now? Just saying we won't see him. No, we can see him. The closer your copies to the criminal, the higher the chances he'll be able to convince the criminal to raise his hands. I'm guessing this is gonna go badly. Hold it right there! Oh, he's doing it, I think. So they're holding for that turn. They've been stunned and they're holding it and such. Now you can arrest them. Arresting criminals immediately disappear from the level and no longer cause you any problems. Unlike dead bodies. Corpses remain lying on the ground so sentries may notice them and raise the alarm. Alright, well let's uh, let's arrest them. Attempt to handcuff the criminal. Face down! Yeah, go down my son. Good job. Okay, we got one boys, we got one. I can move forward. Affirmative. Yeah. Sure this guy's gonna be happy. We can approach the criminal. Will do. To put an immobilized criminal in cuffs, you'll need to stand on a neighboring cell. The diagonal works too. Okay. Well, let's do it. You're under arrest. You are under arrest. Well this is going just nicely, isn't it? Well we not to approach this man. I guess uh, we go here so we can have some cover. Hello, friend. And we can arrest this man as well. Okay, well, that's three arrests made right away. Easy mode. I still don't know what this man is about. I think he's our sniper from far away. I think that was in This is the Police uh, 2. Last time I played it. Like, he had an extra sniper on the map. I think. Yes, we'll take these positions. That's okay. We can open the door. Open it, son. Nobody's gonna see you. Hey, what's this? Hey, what's this? We got something over there. Are you sure you want to go into the room like this? We don't see much. Partners have to look out for each other. If a cop is moving somewhere that a criminal will notice, then any cop nearby him will will warn him of a danger. Just one more reason it's a good idea to keep together. A cop can warn of danger only once per turn. A walkie-talkie symbol on his portrait means the cop hasn't yet spent his turn's warning ability. The eye symbol under Comp's feet means that one of his partners is watching out for him and will warn him in case of danger. Oh, okay. Yeah, don't run in there. There you go. See? I didn't think it would be a smart idea to just rush in there. Oh, there's this man over here, huh? Let's open this door. Good job. Nobody will notice us. Yeah, there he is. Well, hi. We're sneaky. Sneaky beaky like. Good, good. This this makes me want to play XCOM 2 again. <laughs> okay, let's hide over here. There is something interesting there. I want me to shoot him in a taser, huh? A taser is a great way to stun at a distance. It doesn't even need cartridges. But it needs 8 turns to recharge after each shot. Well, I guess taser is what it is. Oh, it's 4 turns stun. Nice. Roger. Let's do it. 8 turns to recharge is quite a lot. Okay. Oh, I guess we're grabbing this man. Ooh, that's a lot in there. Do they have? They have uh, people. Ooh, 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 ooh. That's, that's gonna turn into dangerous stuff. Good. We got one more. It's fourth person. You bet. There's something written over here, isn't it? Uh, what does it say? You'll sometimes come across notes. Some will give you critical information for completing your mission. Others may give you ideas. Okay. Let's read the note. What does it say? Got nothing. Robbie, my patience is at end. This damn door will never open. I called the locksmith for the third time and he promised to come again, but of course he didn't come. It seems like ever since the boss told you his assholes to fuck off, we've been outcasts or something. They don't even want to deliver us pizza anymore. Uncle Red gave me a set of lockpicks. He said they've been laying in the garage since the thieving days of his stormy youth. But I don't know dick about using lockpicks. You try it. Maybe you'll get lucky. Alright. So this man is just walking around, and that's about it. So the, this is a suspect, this is a suspect, these are hostages. Okay, where is your lockpicks and which is the door that is locked? I'm guessing this one. Roger. Hello friends. We okay. Open the window, nobody's gonna even notice that. Nobody's even gonna notice us opening those windows. Roger. Roger. Okay. Ready? 
Study your enemies and you'll notice that everyone behaves differently. Most criminals patrol the area along different routes. An enemy with his arms crossed on his chest won't budge unless he's disturbed. Okay, that's good. So he's a guard. I like the idea of, uh, of uh, visual clues like that. They will see me though, here, right? Yeah, that guy has been disturbed. For sure. So lockpicking, huh? Okay. A locked wooden door can be kicked down, but this will attract the attention of any criminals nearby. You can also try picking the lock. One set of lockpicks is enough for one door. So I'm guessing we got some lockpicks, huh? Bet. You bet. Good. Spotted. Ooh, boy. Okay. We're not going to make it. That man went down. That man definitely went down. Okay. And this guy hid in there. These guys are definitely, uh... What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, we missed him. Good. I'm guessing this is scripted, so it can teach you how things are gonna go. <laughs> Not even a scratch. <laughs> okay. This man is doing good. Okay, there's a bunch of them in there, but the shit just got real. Okay, so we get to shoot the criminal. Livet is down. Maybe we'll use shreds now. Good thing the comp was wearing Kevlar. He can uh, take a couple of shots before he, can, he can't go on. Okay, now your comp can fire back. Accuracy depends on how close you are, how good you are, and whether the enemy is out in the open. So I'm guessing we have half of the Kevlar left. This was a, like a full thing earlier. So how good are you? You're, you're bad. Okay. Well, we'll shoot him. Headshot. Is Lee killed the criminal? Oh. You want me to shoot him in a different area? Okay, well, I guess we'll go for the headshot. Oh, get wrecked. This one too? Wow. Gunfights are only for extreme cases. The noisy shots are sure to extract, attract near any nearby enemies. Well, I'm guessing we're going for more headshots. Okay, can we select something else? I guess not. Okay. Okay. Oh, easy mode. This time you were lucky, but don't expect your cops to always hit their targets. Keep an eye on the accuracy meter and consider your chances. Yeah. Okay, look around. Oh, there you go. Your sniper isn't just a cold-blooded killer. He's also a scout. He can instantly scope out the situation in any room with exterior windows. Oh, we can look in here. This one has no windows. But we can look here. So, scout. Conrad Old Spies. The other criminals are in the vault. Most likely they have hostages. Cool. Uh, we can go to the wounded cop. A wounded cop will die of blood loss if he doesn't get first aid in time. Okay. Okay, that's good to know. We can patch him up. Uh, show me what else. What is he saying? Every cop can take first aid kit on a mission. A small first aid kit will treat injuries to arms and legs and can stop further blood loss from almost any wound. A big kit can fix anything except a bullet to the head. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, let's let's do this. Let's, let's fix him up. We got you, buddy. You're just as good as new. As good as new. Okay, we now need to release the hostages, I guess. Free the hostages. Not all hostages are in good enough shape to make a run for it. Some will have to be carried to an evacuation area. Well, I hope not you. Because I don't want to carry you out of here. You lazy. Oh, we have some more notes over here. Oh, uh, tell me. Tell me. At which point are you going to tell me? There we go. Lock metal doors can't be kicked in or picked. They can be opened by a code, but you'll need to find out what it is. I'm guessing this node's going to tell us. Cindy, the rumors turned out to be true. Ever since the air conditioner broke down, Andy sits in his office shirtless when there are no customers. You can try to take him by surprise. The code from his office is 1111. But just don't tell him that it was me who blurted out the code. Good luck. Well, why'd you write it down and just leave it in the middle, huh? Roger. That didn't go uh, as planned, did it? Suspect's turn. I think the suspects are slightly afraid. What do you want me to do now? Can I actually do things on my own? I wonder. I think it's actually letting me do stuff on my own. Oh yeah. You bet. Let's have you go here. Uh, can I... Yeah, let's, let's go release this hostage. Good, good. Mr. Hostage, right away. let's have you be saved. Okay, I'm, I'm not gonna open the doors yet. I'm fine. We end the turn. Just end the turn. 
End of turn? Oh, have to hold. Okay. I want to bring this cop in as well before we go in there. This man. Let's uh, let's bring this man out here somewhere. There you go Done here for done. now. Done and dusted. All right. Uh, sure. Open the door. One, 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 one. Well, hello there. <laughs> well, hello there, indeed. And I'm guessing the criminals are still in there, so we don't really want to go into a gunfight with them yet, do we? I mean, this is tutorial, so we could. Apparently, LR dice has tr three points. Really? Fine. Let's have you go here. Yeah, there's there's criminals and they have hostages as well, huh? There's a suspect. I oh, do have a taser, but that's on cooldown. Chameleon, Black Knight, patience. He's strong and he's good at shooting. Okay. Well. Yeah. Uh, not. You don't really have good chances now, do you? They will not surrender. But you can take a shot. Sure. Okay, so we have chances to shoot. Just shoot him in the body shot. The defender can, can neither move nor shoot and will bleed for three turns and die. The defender will be unable to move and will bleed six, turn until, six turns until he can die. The defender will be unable to shoot and will bleed for six turns. Instead of kills. Just try to... You bet. The shot to the chest. I think you missed. Well, good thing you have one more point. Try it again. Will do. Will do. Oh, what a miss. Okay. I uh, will bring you in. Hmm. Let's just you go bet. here for now. You bet. Okay, and we need to bring you closer Understood. as well. Good. Can we do something with our sniper in you? No windows. Okay. Can't do much. Let's end the turn then. It's okay. And these guys will probably shoot at us. But chances are they're gonna miss because we have full cover over there. I hope so. After that we need to get in close. Just go go after them. Uh, only misses. What a bunch of pussies. Alright. David. David can uh, go here and still shoot. This man can also go here and shoot. You can't go here. Hmm. And he can't really go far. Let's get you over here. You bet. You bet. Yeah, we're going straight for it. I know we have a uh, bad cover now, but I kind of want to try it out. Okay. Do it. Oh, you missed. Okay. Let's get okay. you here. Can you use your taser yet? No. Shoot him in the chest. Roger. Come on. Oh boy, all the misses. Okay, you can come here and have a shot as well. Now they will have better shots than we do due to the fact that Got we it. have crappy cover. <laughs> Maybe we're missing everything. Dude, just, just use that window to shoot in here, huh? Would have been so nice. Fine, let's end the turn. Uh, this could get hairy now. They can definitely they have four shots on us and we are in half cover Two misses so far. It's good Let's see Okay, three misses. That's pretty good Four misses. Okay, they're they're even worse than we are good thing. We have plenty of bullets. We have eight bullets left uh, We're going full cover over here. I think Okay, okay full cover and we are closer Oh, he might even uh, go down. Let's try it. Don't move. Oh, we failed. Okay. Gotta try it. It was a better chance than uh, anything else. Oh, he can shoot this man over here fully. Just go for a headshot, I think. Is that kills? Can neither move nor shoot. That's fine with me. There you go. He's gonna go down. Chest wound right there. Okay, let's done move you in. And let's see what you can do. Maybe a lucky shot. Who Got knows? It. Attempt it. No, you missed. Okay. Fine. Now they have two shots. And we have one person in half cover. 
Oh, you missed that, did you? You missed that again. Okay, I think we got this now, boys. <laughs> think we got this. All right. Yeah, there you go. Just shoot him. Got it. Let's go. He has done it. The absolute madman. Victory. Achievement unlock. Safe investments. Suspect killed two. Arrested four. Extra jobs completed zero. Valuables found one. Good. We will continue. Onwards to glory. Look at this beautiful car over here. I like it. Checkpoint reach. Awesome. All right. I think this is uh, this is gonna do for the first episode. For now, thank you, buddy, for watching. I do hope you enjoyed it. I'm gonna do a couple more videos. Uh, if you did enjoy it, uh, click the notification bell below if you wanna see more from me. And I'll see you guys next time. Check her out.